Misha, congratulations uh, through to the quarterfinals here in Thank Stuttgart. You. And you come in just uh, one place below your career high ranking of 30 coming into yeah. the grass season. Is this the most important five weeks of your career coming up? Uh, I haven't really thought about it yet, but um, yeah, it's definitely uh, some important weeks coming up because I think I can do well on grass. and. I, uh, one of my dreams would be, you know, to have a two in front of my ranking, and uh, that would be phenomenal. So, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely looking forward, and I want to do well, and let's see what happens. Next up, you're going to play the winner of Tommy Haas and Roger Federer. If it's Roger, that's got to be a very special moment to play him on grass. Yeah. Dare I ask about what happened last time you played? Well, last the time uh, didn't go too well because uh, I wasn't I wasn't able to win a game against him. But that was four years ago in Halle, and. Um, I think, I mean, I would like to think I'm playing better tennis now and uh, uh, I don't think I can do much worse than last time. But the uh, funny thing is that last time I played Tommy was also in Halle and uh, I think I also lost against him back then. Uh, grass courts today aren't as slick as they used to be, uh, but do you feel that you still have advantage on this surface as a natural serve and volleyer? Um, yeah, it, it depends because the grass these days is so good, the quality of the, of the bounce has, uh, has become so good that um, a lot of baseline rallies are being played and, and there's some really long rallies uh, between certain players and but I think you know playing certain volley is definitely easier on grass than, than it is on, on clay for me that's for sure. Will you be serving volleying any more on first and or second serves on grass than on other surfaces? Um, it depends on the player but I would say yes yeah normally I would, I would serve and volley a lot especially on the first serve I don't think I would ever stay back on the first serve but um, on the second serve I have to see you know who I'm playing against and how they return. Do you get a sense that tennis fans in general enjoy watching you play because they, they miss the serve and volley days? Um, I mean I'm happy to hear that whenever somebody comes up and says we, we love your game because you play serve and volley it's, it's uh, something nice for me I really enjoy hearing it and um, yeah, it's, it, it makes me proud because I know there's not many guys out there that still play serve and volley. So being one of them and you know winning a few matches here and there and you know trying to do some damage is definitely a good thing. If the grass courts were faster today, like they were back in the Edberg yeah. Becker Sampras days, would we see more serve and volley champions on grass court events like Wimbledon, or is the return just too powerful a weapon these days? Um, no, I think if the grass court was a little bit faster, maybe there's. There were a, bit, a few more uh, big servers that you know would become champions, but you know it's it's tennis has become such a tough sport because it's so physical and everybody is is becoming faster and stronger and quicker and the reaction is better, so that the returners are getting better and better. So they're able to no matter how big the serve is, the, the returners are able to neutralize the the opponent's serve so well that honestly, you know what? I don't know. Maybe we should try it one year. You know, you know, make the grass go really fast and see who's going to win. Your younger brother Sasha is now number 10 in the world, but yeah. if you had to play him on grass, do you think you could take him out? Or have you ever bantered about that? Uh, well, we do play a lot of uh, practice sets against each other, and um, let's say, let's, let's put it that way, I win the majority of them, so we'll see. But um, we've never played on grass in a real match, so that's, that's different too. But um, I, think, I think I would know how to play against him on grass.